What's going on guys? It's Colin here for Next Gen Tactics. And it feels like forever since I've just done a regular commentary to talk to you folks here on the main channel. See how everyone's doing and how you're enjoying the Battlefield content. So I've been chatting with Spiderbite and you're going to be seeing a lot more of me around here. I'm going to be posting a lot more videos to this channel. And the reason that I kind of wanted to talk to you was to let you know the things that I've been up to and what sort of content you'd like me to bring to Next Gen Tactics as far as Battlefield 3 is concerned. Uh, that's my primary shooter right now and as other games come out, obviously. Obviously, I'm going to assess that situation, but for now, you know, I'm kind of the battlefield guy here on the channel. And I've only been posting on Mondays, but we're going to up the ante on that for sure. And I've been using those videos up with my Battlefield 3 strategy series and my Bring Your X Game series where I enlisted the help of Rival X Factor, who's a competitive BF3 player on Team Rival, in order to help me improve my game. And I think that that's had a, a significant impact on my play. And many of you have given me uh, some great feedback that you're really loving that series, so we'll definitely be continuing it. Couldn't get a hold of Rival X Factor today to post this, uh, make one of those tonight, but since I'm going to be posting on a more regular basis, no worries, that series will be continuing. So, I wanted to find out what other type of content you want here on Next Gen Tactics. I want to be delivering high quality content that you enjoy watching, so that's why I'm throwing it out there for suggestions. Now if you're following me on my channel, you know some of the things that I've had going on recently. I have a new series started called Colin's Angels, where I team up with a couple of lady friends who also happen to be incredible PTFO minded battlefield players, and you know, we play objective game types for the most part. And Sometimes those commentaries take on a very serious tone, we're being tactical, sometimes it's a little bit more fun, but if that's something that you'd like to see here on NGT, I can definitely give it a go. I'm also currently participating in an 8v8 Conquest tournament with uh, a number of other YouTubers mixed in with some competitive Battlefield players, and it's definitely a different level of play. You know, you don't go beasting on the other team, it's uh, much more methodical, you know, you play a role, you stick to it. If that's the type of gameplay you'd like to see, then let me know in the comments section. You know, I'm, I'm flexible as to what I can bring to the channel. Something else that I thought about is, is maybe a new series where, you know, a lot, I know a lot of other folks will... Um, put it out there to the user base to suggest a loadout that they're going to use. Well, what I think I might try and do with you guys is not just go with a loadout, but, you know, a game type or a map that maybe, you know, you think you have a great tactic for that you want me to try out, or maybe something that you're struggling with, whether that's a kit, a map, a game type, and you want me to try playing it your way in order to see how I make out and maybe give some tips and suggestions on uh, how to make that work for you a little bit better. I'm, I'm open to ideas and if that sounds like a good idea then let me know. I'm, uh, as I said, very, very flexible, but I just am having a great time playing the game. I know that Spiderbite is uh, not playing as much BF3. He is on PS3 and it has been a bit of a frustrating experience for many of the console players I know. I recently put the game back in for Xbox, and, you know, I had a good time, but there were definitely some challenges. I do play primarily on the PC. Now, if you want to see something on Xbox or, or PS3, I can probably do that. I'm not likely to get involved too much in the PS3 until we hit the point where the DLC is about to drop, and then I'll pick it up again, you know, knock off the rust with the PS3 controller and try and do some work, give some early impressions on that DLC. DLC content, which is coming out in June, close quarters. Very excited about that. I actually had the chance to play that at PAX East, and I liked what I saw. It's not as hectic and chaotic as one might think. The, the maps play very well, so that's going to be great. I'm going to definitely check those out and give you some thoughts on, on that close quarters content, bring you lots of coverage. So, beyond that, you know, things are have been going well for me. Still busy. I have to actually go away for work this week, so there's not going to be a ton of content that I post here on the main channel this week. But starting next week, I will do my best to try and uh, <laughs> give you guys your Battlefield 3 fix here on Next Gen Tactics, and I'm very much looking forward to it. Another project that I'm getting involved with is called Project PTFO, and what we're doing is setting up a, a 4v4 squad rush tournament. The teams are made up of two YouTubers and two viewers or subscribers that want to try and get involved. So every week, uh, two YouTubers are going to be teamed up with, with two subscribers who sign up in, in order to play in the tournament, and I think that it's going to be a blast. So you can check out more on that if you want to try and play with me. I will be playing on the Xbox and the PC. I'll be competing in two different brackets. So you can check that out at projectptfo.com. 
And as always, you know, you can uh, see what's going on with me by following me on Facebook and Twitter. Those links will also be in the description. And if you don't watch my channel as it is today, anything that isn't going up on NGT will be happening on my channel. Now, I started out this video with some rush footage. We're going to move into a, just a little bit of TDM to finish this off. And what I've been working on is, is trying to get on target faster and work on some snap shooting where I only duck out of cover for a second take a few shots, duck back under cover. And it's it's still a technique that I'm learning. Um, when I pull it off effectively, it is definitely a deadly way to be playing Battlefield 3 as infantry. So, you know, that's been going pretty well. Just wanted to show you a little bit of my progress. So this is like a 12-0 run, I think, to start a TDM, followed up by a couple of other decent clips that I got from the game. And it was one of those 500 ticket jobs. So I was in this game for like 25 minutes. Not going to bring the whole of gameplay, but, uh, you know, just a few highlights. So, I know that many folks that uh, are fans of Battlefield 3 don't really like watching TDM. It's something that I tend to play when I'm working on, um, you know, a new technique. Gun skills, gunplay, that sort of thing. Don't have to focus on objectives. Don't have to focus on vehicles. Just go out there and get some kills. And I have fun playing that. I have fun mixing it up with Russian Conquest, to be honest. So, I'm going to be playing some more Squad Rush as a part of Project PTFO, which is a game type that I have not played much of whatsoever. So... We shall see how that goes. And, you know, if any of those series sound appealing to you, let me know in the comment section. I will bring them here to the main channel as opposed to on my YouTube channel. So, up to you guys what you want to see. Otherwise, you know, I can I'm just try and break down my gameplay, try and bring you some map tactics and that sort of thing because I know that... Uh, when I made that content in Bad Company 2, it went over really well. So, I'm gonna try and, you know, give you some thoughts on how I play particular maps. I have been playing a lot more Rush lately when the game first released, especially on PC. It was all Conquest all the time, pretty much, so I've been mixing it up, and anyway, just glad to be able to post more content here on NGT. You guys are awesome, and I'm looking forward to it, so do a bit of kit switching here because I'm out of ammo, and this is coming, uh, my 12-0 run is coming to an end here. But uh, let me know what you thought about the video. Let me know if you like the direction that this is heading. As always, uh, an honest rating or a comment is greatly appreciated. And lots of information in the description for you guys to check out. So that's the end of the run. Now we're uh, just a couple of other clips where I'm just trying to work on my gunplay. And I've been playing a lot with the M16. I know that many of you are probably sick of it. No worries. I will be mixing it up soon and playing around with other weapons and kits. I actually even busted out the support kit the other night because we had... Uh, Mortar troubles while we were defending on Rush and Operation Metro. I pulled out my, my support kit and counter mortared them. So I don't play that often. I'm usually either medic slash assault or engineer, but I'm willing to mix it up. There's not going to be a lot of sniping out of me. That's just not my style, but other than that, I'm open for just about anything. And hell, even if you want to see me snipe a little bit, I can do that too. Not well, mind you, but I'll try. <laughs> Anyway, another little streak, and I think we're going to finish this thing off with a triple spray. So, hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and you'll be seeing lots more of me, as I said. I think that's it for me. Cheers. We'll talk soon.